Hi friends, I will show you how to do a basic excavation model in Plexus 3D. For this purpose, I will amend an existing model, add a soil layer to it, and uh, do the excavation. So this is a basic model for the tutorial one. To amend it, go under soil properties, and under the model, I would like to change the extent of this model. So X minimum, I'll change it to minus 75. And similarly for Y minimum. Okay. Second thing I want is uh, add another uh, the, uh, uh, add another layer. It's a single layer currently. So to do that, go into modify soil layers, add and, uh, and the minus 10. And I'll find a material, maybe, you know, let's use it as stiff sand. Uh, I don't know what does it mean by stiff sand. St sands are not stiff, but they could be dense. But here we are. Okay. Right. Now, go on the structure. What I wanted to do is, just get rid of this. Uh, to excavate in four meter deep uh, the uh, excavation uh, with the sides that not for one in two uh, um, sides so what I need to do is the um, uh, create a surface but for that I'll do a top view there are a number of ways you can do it but what I prefer is look at the top view so you are only dealing with the two dimensions rather than three dimension so create a surface yep. and now I will amend the points so we want 30 by 30 as excavation so it needs to be 15 50 and that needs to be 15 and this needs to be 24 is uh, 15 uh, I want it minus 4 so minus 4 is the depth below the surface so this is 15, this is minus 15, and this is minus 4, and minus 15, minus 15, minus 4, and I want this as minus 4 as well. Okay, this is my first excavation done. Now I need to draw the outer boundary of the excavation. So, as I said, it still be... 10 meters from the base of excavation so uh, basically one in two and half uh, slope angle right what I need to do is change this slope angle we got this point as minus 15 so this needs to be minus 25 uh, 25 and I want this at surface so this needs to be zero Again, minus uh, 25, minus uh, 25, and 0. Now, with this side here, similarly, again, if you got the coordinates, you can just type it in. But I'm um, telling, uh, I'm, I'm showing it manually how it can be done if you want to draw it or you don't have the luxury of having the coordinates. Or you can always uh, import the, the geometry of the excavation and uh, if you got a CAD file. Okay, so this is our excavation. That's what it looks like and in perspective view, that's what we are looking at. So we got the um, base of excavation around 4 meter below the surface and then we got the outlines of the crest at the, at the top. Now how would I create the excavation itself? So right click on this base polygon, look at that, this is minus 4. Right click on it and go into decompose into outlines. What it will do is it creates outer lines all the way around it, which you, uh, you can use. To extend uh, your extend your 
excavation. So to do an excavation, cl click on create surface and hold down the tab key. And remember where it's getting yellow, that's where you need to click on. That's when you select it. So again, the second point there. And now I need to come up. I not find there. I'll add a point and I will put it as a what will be that minus 25 minus 25 and this will be I think I made a mess of it let's delete it uh, and this and this and try again okay again hold down the tab key and get it correct there this point here that one there and this one there here we are so this is our one side excavated now I repeat the procedure all the way around hold on the tab key okay and amend any points which have got not selected right coordinate uh, 25 Okay, change this to fifteen and that needs to be zero. Zero. I think I'll get an issue with the mesh here. We'll see. Okay, now the final surface, hold on the tab key. So then, that's what our squishion look like. Okay, go into mesh. Generate mesh. Okay, mesh created. And you're not modeling it. I'm not gonna model it or I'm not gonna change the water. So flow condition, if you wanna amend the water, that's what way you will do it under stage construction okay this is my excavation how does it look like okay you can view it here you can use control e to explode it and okay that's why it look like and if I implode it control shift e go back here and and when you want to excavate it what you need to do is just undo the cluster here so this is your excavation done yep I hope uh, you have uh, find it useful. Well, here we are. Thank you.